Hey, Pluto Nights Jr. back in the video. I'm here to you guys to explain to you guys more about my little rant videos and everything I do. So on this channel, so basically to recap all of it, there's this kid that was just big being a fag and he dated this girl that I told not to date and then he dated her and then meanwhile all this other stuff, he was like maybe that you can, he was like trying to blow it up in my face that his relationship was going good. But then she dropped him and then me and her became friends and now she dated him again and then he became just like under my books, like he just been under the boot now, he's retarded, I don't, we're not friends anymore, that's basically and now he probably feels like ass because he doesn't have friends at this school because he keeps saying that he has friends at the other school that nah, I don't give a fuck actually. But, but anyway, um, this video I just want to be talking about um, these two girls specifically in my class. I don't really care if they know watch this video. But there's just one girl that's actually Hiccup Chill. There's in his act, right? There's his act. The, the faggot, the, you know, the faggot guy's act, yeah. The faggot girl. I mean, fuck. Um, the guy, act. the guy I was talking about, how he has friends now, but he's not. And that's him. So, yeah. Um, also, guys, I don't think I explained it in my last video, but the paperboy's actually dropping a diss track on the homie Kaga19. I don't know when, but. Anyways, back to the story. Though, this is girl. The guy's dropped his act because he thought he was too pretty. Or some BS. I explained it in another video. If you guys didn't watch it, go watch it. Um, and this other girl who backs him up all the time, like, sh um, she keeps saying it on this sh on her streak that 1111 this special someone. Um, I don't know because I kept asking her who it was, and then she said it's someone else from my other school. And I was like, uh, that's what they all say. Me and my homie always say like that's what they all say. Like, all right, do you? And they, she said, and now I'm kind of getting this feeling that she likes this other guy. But um, she said. I ruined our friendship, but at the end of the day, I don't think we really had a friendship because the way she was acting, or the way apparently I was acting, how rude I am towards him after all this BS he put me through. And then I was asking the other day how um how would she feel if um this person was talking stuff about someone who you really cared about? You think? And then she was basically implying that you just get back, be friends with him, like it was nothing happened or whatever. Dude, that's basically like being punched in the face, and then like we're gonna be friends. Like what? <laughs> okay, and I'm not gonna do anything back. That's retarded. I'm not like that. Revenge always comes sweet with your boy. And now this kid is always like every time when this kid try to say something in class, we just have like a squad just squad up on him and just like put this kid on blast. Like I don't know why he's still alive at this point, but nah, I shouldn't even get in that. That's yeah. So this girl in class, every time we just let put this kid on blast, it's always my fault that it's like my fault that these other kids. Sometimes I don't even do anything, and then it just it's always just my fault that they want to put him on blast, and then. I sometimes I don't do anything and they're saying like I did it all and it's just chicks always saying I'm doing this and then I thought we were friends at some point because me and her are pretty friends I would we would say but I wouldn't say that we're friends anymore because in class well yesterday just like smirked it right there like we just lit a match I think we just lit a match or something just sparked up inside of me was like okay bro I can't deal with this chick I think this is exactly why I have so much stress but anyways I just wanted to talk about just to talk about this girl well not this girl but talk about this chick um his the other the, the dude is ex like I lightweight feel bad for her because how she just got dropped and she actually liked this kid but this kid was just like neglecting her and that kind of sounds like what I do to my girlfriend on. I can't do anything. I hate that. You know, I had so many opportunities to talk to her. It's like, <gasps> okay, tomorrow is. Yeah, tomorrow is the time. Try my ass off to talk to her because I'm making that a goal. 2018. We're getting more close. I'm out. I had one quick thing to say also to add before I would just edit in this video. But one more thing to add is actually um, comment down below if you think um, like me not talking to my girlfriend is a bad well, it is a bad thing, but like, it, is it like my thing or like, do I always always have to approach her or can she approach me like that's kind of the, the deal that i a deal breaker that i was thinking um i was just saying i just want to quickly say that but yeah um just think about that leave advice um comment please comment i really need you guys advice so just tell me guys if it if i if like if i should only like only be the one that go up to her and talk to her or like can she be the one to approach that's what i really want to know but so yeah guys oh Catch your peace.